Hello dear traders, welcome back to Insta TV. You're watching Financial News with me, Anna Kasatkina. On Monday, WTI futures recovered after previous session's sharp decline amid signs of lower drilling activity in the US, which is declining on the back of a summer slump in oil prices. On the COMEX division of the New York Mercantile Exchange, WTI futures surged by 73 cents or 1.63 percent to the level of 45.76 US dollars a barrel during European trading hours. Last Friday, crude prices lost 4.63 62 percent on NYMEX as investors trading sentiment was depressed by the Fed's discouraging outlook for the global economy. In addition, Baker Hughes, one of the world's largest oil field services companies, announced that the number of drilling rigs in the United States contracted by 8 to 644 last week, posting a decline for the third consecutive week. During last month's crude prices were heavily influenced by sales as commodity prices had slumped due to pressure from mounting concerns about the oversupplied market. The Chinese flash manufacturing PMI from Caixin is due to be released on Wednesday, which could help investors assess stability of the global economic growth. Analysts expect the index to hit the level of 47.5 in September, compared to the final reading of 47.3 in the preceding month, which was the lowest level since March of 2009. Currently, investors are focused on the U.S. data about durable goods orders and home sales, which is due to be released later today. Market participants are full of hopes to see sign of recovery in the country's economy in order to count chances for interest rate hikes to take place in the nearest term. Follow the latest financial developments together with us on Insta TV. See you back soon. Bye.